you have something that's effective, and you have something that needs to be heard more about, okay? And I'm willing to do my part. I'm a guy who, I've chosen another path. I can't make money on people's suffering. I have to be a public servant. I can't keep my recovery and have a, a get-rich scheme for me. I can't do that. I've chosen to live in a simple place, with a simple bed, work all day, go out, work hard, come home. I work seven days a week, I work 12 hours a day. I continuously never let up, and I continuously never give up. What did you say, Carl? I turned uh, uh, what? lemon to lemonade. Lemon to lemonade. <laughs> That's kind of what I do. I turn lemon to le lemons to lemonade. That's what I do. And a lot of that's systemic. You know, systemic. You know, we we who have these psychiatric conditions, we are a people. We are a culture. We have a history. Okay, we are a people. We have a culture. But we've never been united. We've never been acknowledged. We've never been accepted. But there are a lot of people out there who haven't been accepted for years. But our time is coming. More and more states today realize the importance of peer support. More and more states today want to do this. But the biggest tidal wave of all is coming from my area. In the next 10 years, probably, there will be more discussion, more front page coverage. Carl and I both did Nightline years ago. That's how it comes out of Carl. There'll be more media than ever before. Why? The troops are coming home. Oh. some kind of post-traumatic stress disorder, some kind of mental illness, chronic depression, lots of anxiety, all the things the Dr. Lowe talked about. Low-grade irritability, anger, they're all coming back, okay? The VA, I found it strange. The day before, we all volunteered for Obama. You see, I got my whole shirt. <laughs> I'm an Obama guy every, every day of the week. Every day for the next four years, I wear an Obama shirt. So before we did our community service um, on uh, Martin Luther King's birthday, which I was in a homeless shelter on that day, community service, that Sunday, because that was on Monday, the VA released, I guess, kind of a low news day and it went under the radar screen, was their official estimates on veterans with psychiatric conditions coming back from this war. 439,000 folks. Wow. If you divide that by 48, 50, and I were to take about seven to 8,000 new people and dump them in any state mental health system right now with the waiting lists and the underfunded services that we have, that would literally blow that system out of the water, okay? Whether you're California, whether you're Illinois, whether you're anybody, okay? And the troops are coming home. And the only way I think that we are going to get our people, Americans, in this thing, those four S's again, sane, stable, safe, and sober, is working with each other. Those that are doing better have a moral responsibility yes. to go back and work with those that aren't doing as well. This yeah, each yeah. one, reach yes. one, teach one. Yeah. Okay? That's yeah. the only way to work. You know, folks? I've been doing it about 20 years, probably longer than anybody else. I got three Yale research studies behind me. But you know what? You've been doing it longer. Okay? You've been doing it longer. And you have my respect for that. And so I'm going to do my part to open the doors for you. I feel as though that you've been under-acknowledged and under-recognized, and I'm going to do my part to change that. I'm loud, I don't know if I'm effective. <laughs> 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 Time will tell my effectiveness. You know, I'm a big believer in history, okay? but I'm loud. So I want to really thank you for inviting me here. I want to thank you, and I also want to take time to ask or, or to have you ask questions. Again, I, I want to take time to really thank you for taking you in, uh, me into your lives, and I hope that I do as right by you over the next year as you've done for me over the 
this past 24 hours, and I'm grateful to be here. Thank you very much.